want to show matrices like sales or profit with big bold numbers, something like this. Let's create KPI cards in seconds. So let's move on to a new page over here. Now here we will be creating the KPI cards. First of all, I will click on the blank area of the canvas and then I will go to the visualization pane and click on this card. After which a blank KPI card will appear. Now what we have to do is we have to drag and drop the metric that we want to show in this card. So here what I will do, I will show total sales. Here I have already created a measure for total sales. So I will select the visual and then I will drag and drop this total sales measure into the field. And boom, you have created your first KPI card. Now what we have to do, we have to do some formatting. So I will do formatting for this card. I will just adjust it properly. And then we will do all the formatting in the format or visual option. So first of all, what I will do, I will decrease the font size of this. I will make it 30. And then the category label, which is there, I will just pop it and I will add a title instead. So the difference between them is the category label appears at the bottom and title will appear at the top. I will name it total sales. I will center align it and then I will go to effects. And here, I will add the visual border and I will have a rounded corners of pen and then I will also add shadows to it. Now we have done with the basic formatting of this card. We can explore other formatting options as well for the card and a pro tip would be to use multiple cards at top of the dashboard for a very keen KPI section. Follow for more Power BI hacks every week.